te vragen. Good morning. We are going to Prague. It is like half past ten in the morning and I'm super tired because I didn't sleep so much last night. I have to do my parents' tax declaration until Monday and honestly I've had so much time and I just didn't do it because I'm too lazy. I started yesterday at 10 and well I didn't finish but I worked on it until 2 and then I woke up at 7 so I'm quite tired uh, but yeah also very excited. Why are you crying? Huh? What's your <laughs> What's your problem? Huh? Tell it. Tell it to the camera. Okay, no problem. Just crying like me. I don't know. Nothing's wrong, but sometimes you just have to cry. We decided to take the doggies. And we're gonna be staying so. Uh, and we're going to be staying in a hotel for Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday, so four days because this week is a long weekend. I usually don't work on Friday, so we are we can go today and then we can also stay Monday. It's always a little bit of a struggle to take the dogs anywhere because for one thing, they don't let you into every restaurant and also <laughs> you never know if they're gonna pee on the hotel carpet. I mean, usually they wouldn't, but you don't know if there's a certain smell or something and they, or they get diarrhea or something or they just want to destroy stuff, so that's that. And then also, which one thing I'm really sad about with the dogs is you can't go to bars at night because you can't leave them that well in the hotel room uh, might be that they bark or they just cry the whole time you know and also I'm very sad that we can't go to a jazz bar which Prague is really famous for and Prague has very nice jazz bars but I mean, if I don't take them, I miss them so much, I don't even want to go anywhere without them. We arrived, finally. There was so much traffic. Oh my god, I think like two hours on a five hour drive. Well, I mean, we're here now. This hotel is so nice. I think it's one of the nicest hotels I've ever stayed in. Look. So, this is the room. It's a small room, but it's so nice. Guys, what's wrong? So, here's the door, and then there's a bathroom with a bathtub. Looks really posh, everything. <laughs> And then this is the bed and it has a very nice picture of Prague. And then we have the wood ceiling which is also very nice and then like the window is kind of like a like a castle window. It's like a double one and it's really thick. Like the thing is really thick. And then you have an, a really nice view of park. If you go uh, outside here, so there's the gate, and you go outside, and then you're actually <laughs> in the city, right in the city. Now we're gonna go have some food probably because I'm super hungry, and the boyfriend is super hungry, and yeah. We'll see each other later or tomorrow. Let's see. We 
We watch the sun go down over the same old town Like so many times before we Look at the same old stars, battle the same old wars Like so many times before And I know that we're not perfect Yesterday we had dinner at this, I don't know, burger place, I think, <laughs> because we just arrived and we got super hungry and then we just looked on TripAdvisor and it had good rating and the food was actually really good and the stuff was nice and they had a really cute thing, so um, I don't know if all restaurants in the park have it, but you could buy um, a food food a meal for a local like elderly person who is like um, too poor to buy his own meals so that was cute and today we, <laughs> we tried to wake up early but it is now like quarter to nine and we are going to the castle and then I think we're going to the city there's a lot of fog and it's super cold Hands are freezing, but it's so nice, so beautiful. Everything's empty, except for a few Indian tourists. <laughs> Look at this you guys. Imagine you have the you have to build something like this and think of something like this. It's so beautiful. And then imagine building all that without like machines with your hands. Look at this. Sadly, it's so foggy you can't really see anything, but in theory, you would have a really nice view. Moon, come back. Come back. Okay, go. So we came to the old. Town right? and the city center, and we're at a Starbucks because no other place had hot chocolate. And I don't drink uh, coffee, I get panic attack when I drink coffee. So, yeah, we're here, oh, we're here having hot chocolate and warming Forget up. We share a bond no matter what cause you have a piece of my heart and I know that we're not perfect but I'm gonna miss all that we had yeah I know that we're not perfect but I need this night for the last time stay stay no you're gone in the 
we're at the farmer's market now and we got some pastry and then we got this um, bread with parsley pesto and basil pesto and then this is um, this is butter yeah so let's try this that looks so nice Mm. Very good. <laughs> They're really good. Mm. The bread is also really good. This is also like super fresh. Yeah. Like the bread is fresh and the pesto is fresh and let's try this one. Mm. Oh my god, this is real good. Mm. This would also be super good with noodle. This is pretty good. I wanna try this. Poppy pastry. Mm. No, not for you. Careful, like, like flying in the sea. Mm, it's very sweet. Mm. We have this in Germany too. It's like a yeast um, dough. And then you can put different stuff. Very good. Man, we just walked like 30, 40 minutes to get a Czech hot dog because I googled where's the best one and where to eat. And it's not open on weekends. So let's. We're gonna look if there's another store here, near here. Hi. It is half past seven and <laughs> we just went back to the hotel for a quick nap. I don't know where I left off. I think we went to get the Czech hot dog and it was closed and then I got very hungry and so we quickly got some ramen and then we went home to the hotel for a nap and now we're going out to dinner and we're just trying to get the traditional Czech dishes and some beers and then we're gonna head back because the boyfriend has to do some stuff at 11 at the hotel. We're just walking to the restaurant and I realized that while COVID in Germany is getting worse and worse again, people in other countries still seem to ignore it or, I don't know, have no problems with it. So I guess what I wanted to say is for anyone who is interested, um, in the hotel people are not wearing masks. In the restaurants people are not wearing masks, in the street people are not wearing masks. I mean sometimes the staff is wearing masks, but most of the time nobody is. So basically we don't have any restrictions at all. So for anyone that was wondering about that. <laughs> Sunday and we woke up late today and now everything's crowded <laughs> um, so we already went to the like smallest street the most narrow street in Prague which is like 
50 centimeters and then we want to go to the uh, Altstadt today and then we want to go to this one butchery but butchery 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 which butchery. is like butchery like pretty famous and then we want to eat the scone with the ice cream which they have everywhere i don't know um if that is necessarily a Prague dish because we have it in Germany too and I don't know but yeah <laughs> it is good anyway so yeah that's what we're gonna do today.